morning, baby. You're up late. Just face time, friends. Get any packing done? <sighs> Not yet. We should start. Maybe we could do some tomorrow. You really can't wait to get rid of me. What? No, that wasn't it. You sure? Because it kind of feels like it. Still got a month. Panicking before you leave. I'll miss you every day. It's gonna be really weird not having you around here. Having the house to myself. Okay. I'll get on it, I promise. Don't worry, there's still plenty of time for me to panic. Smart ass. Whoa, is this the place you're showing today? All 70 acres. This place is amazing. Look at that view. Is that a movie theater? Yes, it is an at-home theater. <laughs> this place was a huge get for me. I sell this, it'll move me into the higher-end sales market. Not to mention the commission I'll net. You'll sell it. I know you will. This place sells itself. On your lip. Okay, what's up? What do you mean? We never go out to dinner anymore. What's the occasion? Nothing. It's just... We haven't spent much time together this summer, and you're leaving. Besides, two ladies can't go out on the town and have some fun? Okay. As long as you're not using me as your ringwoman. <laughs> Trust me. The only thing I'm in the market for is some sushi. <laughs> okay, sounds great. Good luck today. It's gonna be great. Thank you. Idea how hard I had to work to convince them. Oh, I'm sure. Congrats. Thanks. Today's the first day on the market, so you'll probably see a lot of cars around you don't recognize. Well, I, uh, I won't harass them too much. No promises, though. You know, uh, a lot of the uh, folks around here are gone for the weekend. It's the dilemma of having multiple houses, right? I wouldn't know. Mm. Yeah, I've been up there once or twice just to check on things. That's a big piece of land. Come on up if you have time. I'll give you the tour. Maybe you'll want to make an offer. Well, on my salary? <laughs> Good luck. Thanks. do this. Hello? Just wanted to check in, make sure you didn't need anything before the big day. I'm good. As ready as I can be. Smell that? Pine trees? Multiple offers. Over asking. That's what that is. <laughs> you know, I still don't know how you convinced them to sell. And I've been trying to bag this listing for years. I told them how hot the market is, what I would do to help them sell. I think they just really wanted to hear the truth. Really? That worked? I'll have to try it sometime. <laughs> You know, I'm looking forward to having you on the team. After this sells, we'll, uh, we'll get your home on the market. Uh, maybe not quite so fast. I just want to get Heather settled at school first. You still haven't told her. I don't know how to. It's the only home she's ever known. I get it. I know how, how much it means to you. But don't let it hold you captive. You know, like we tell our clients, 
It's what fills a house that makes it a home. Besides, from what you've told me, she seems like a smart kid. She'll understand, and she'll want what's best for you. Where's Miss? Before she leaves. Besides, you don't want to miss the market. Speaking of, I've got my own appointment to get to. But uh, check in with me before the end of the day. I want to hear how much they love the place. Sure thing, boss. I swear, it's like she's pushing me out the door. For sure that's not it. It is. It's like she can't wait to get rid of me. Did you talk to her about it? No. You should. Let her know that's how you feel. I just don't get why she's so eager for me to go. It's probably just a defense mechanism. Think about it. First, your dad, now you heading off to college. I mean, she's about to be alone for the first time in no dinner tonight. Thanks, you're the best. Oh, I know. I keep telling people I deserve my own daytime talk show, but they don't listen. <laughs> Welcome. I'm Susan. Come in. A total of 6,000 square feet and every amenity that you can imagine. The game room, the pool and shuffleboard table come with the house. Great way to keep the kids occupied for hours. A temperature controlled wine cellar capable of holding over a thousand bottles. The original property was a winery, so much of what you see here is personal reserve. Here's its own at-home theater with built-in surround sound and Wi-Fi for streaming. And all of it guarded by a high-end security system and wireless surveillance cameras with an intercom system across the entire property. There's also a lockdown switch here, which automatically secures all exterior doors and windows. A total of 70 acres of fenced land, ensuring your privacy. You won't hear them, and they won't hear you. Or your baby. Amazing. It's even better than the pictures. I know. It's really something. So, how'd it go? Great. <laughs> <laughs> Multiple people said they want to make an offer. We'll see who actually does. That's great, Mom. I'm so happy for you. What is going on out there? We passed a whole slew of police cars on our way here. They run out on the main road. Something happened, that's for sure. I'm starving. Can you go? Sure. Let me just pack up. Oh, great. It never fails. More buyers? Looks like it. It's after five. I'll tell them to come back. Really? Why? I mean, you're here, they're here. May as well show them. Who knows? Could be the people that grossly overpay. You want to do the showing? <laughs> nope. It's all you. I'll hide in the back when you do your thing. Hi. But it's fine. Come on in. Thank you. I swear we will be in and out of here as fast as possible. This is the main living area. It has an open floor plan that leads right to the kitchen. Wow. Look at this place. Are you all right? You're sweating. Air conditioner cut down the car. I'm fine, thanks. Typical, right? <laughs> 
Something going on out there. It's the third siren I've heard. I can't even notice anything. Upstairs, we have two more bedrooms as well as the master suite. <clears throat> have you seen many properties? Uh, a few, but nothing we've loved yet. Well, it's hard not to love this one. It's five bedrooms, four baths, it's on 70 acres of land. For those nights, you need to work out the kinks. <laughs> Looks like you could use one now. Let me see. I'm fine. <clears throat> oh my god. We need to get your help. We're not calling anyone. Not as long as you do what we say. <gasps> Who else is here? No one, it's just me. Downstairs. are still all over the streets. Should have kept moving. Taking our chances. I think we've taken enough chances for one day. So all that's because of you. We just need a place to lay low for a while. Till the cops go. Think you'll make it that long? you know one house is settling You look like you could use some water.
You're a liar. One of the buyers must have left it. Hmm. Nice try. Where is she? My guess, probably halfway to those cuffs by now. If you leave right now, you might be able to get away. Where? I don't know. Where's the security system? What security? She's outside. Southeast corner of the property. She's headed for the road. The car. Go! No! Don't you touch her! Don't you touch her! Don't you hurt her, I swear! Get it! You lie to me again. It is going to get very bad. Both of you. Cops are still over the streets. Better not get comfy. Before you tie me up, we should probably take care of that. You're obviously not making it to a hospital anytime soon. You're losing blood. Not to mention, you're sort of bleeding all over the carpet. There's a first aid kit in my car. I'll go. They do anything stupid? put them out of sight just in case anything else I know you're both scared just cooperate and no one will get hurt It'd be a lot easier to believe if you weren't covered in blood For the record, this was never part of the plan. There was a plan. There's always a plan. It always goes off without a hitch. This seems to be a pretty big hitch. Consciousness. Any 
Anything else, Your Highness? I guess just some towels. I need you to take that off. Good news is the bullet went right through. Bad news is we have two holes to stitch. the showings went. Typical. All about the money. You should let me text him back so he doesn't worry. No. No contact. I can't be sure you won't slip him a message. You'll tip him off. This is gonna hurt. Worse than a gunshot. used to stitch all your clothes. Your father and I didn't have much when we started. <laughs> you think I don't know what it's like to struggle? To worry? Worry about what? Buying your next $2,000 bag? You don't think I know what that's worth? You know, folks like you, your idea of being broke is having to skimp on your yearly trip to Cabo. We've never been to Cabo. <laughs> the point is, behind giant gates, your private security, the haves and have mores. You know, always helping each other while everyone else outside of the gates has to fight for what's left. For scraps. <sighs> We're just even in the score a little. Hey, can we debate ethics later and let the woman focus? Not everything's what it seems. I'm just trying to make a living, provide for my family. And the bag's a knockoff. That's a security gate. Ignore him, he'll go away. With everything going on out there, do you really think that? He's obviously not leaving. I can get rid of him. But we have to let him up. Oh, here, Rick, like, why would we trust you? Think it through. He obviously saw the lights. If we don't answer, he's gonna call it in. Where does that go? I'll convince him. Fine, but you let him in here, it's going to end very bad. I will make sure of that. Hello? Sheriff's Department, could you open the gate, please, ma'am? Sir, can I help you? So we're going door to door, checking the neighborhood. It's a little late for an open house. That ended at five. <laughs> so I just got drawn into some work calls and emails. Lost track of time. 
Also, it's quieter here. No kids. Uh, I keep hearing sirens. Did something happen? There was a break-in down the street. Really? Not the first that we've had lately. Seems to be the same pair that's been doing this for months. Well, I, I hope no one was hurt. I'm afraid so. The intruders killed the homeowner. You did one of them. Have you noticed anything unusual tonight? Anyone you didn't recognize? Honestly, dozens of people came through. All strangers. Are you sure? Everything's okay, ma'am? Um, <laughs> you're just kind of freaking me out a little. Um, I am, I'm definitely gonna go straight home ASAP. That's a good idea. Just so you know, the neighborhood's been cordoned off. Thank you for letting me know. You get home safe. I will. You be safe out there. Hold on. Did you hurt yourself? Such a klutz. <laughs> Bloody Mary mix. I've been serving them all day to potential buyers. You have no idea what you have to do to entice buyers nowadays. <laughs> I can make you one if you'd like. No, thank you, ma'am. I'm on duty. Right. That, duh. Get home safe. Make sure the... roadblocks. That should hold until we get real medical attention. Uh, yeah, we're sort of... that cop said you killed the owner of that other house not me she had to but not before he got a shot off lucky me right luckier than him no one was supposed to come home and there were never guns that was my rule i opened guns not before today I didn't even know she had one. Maybe she just didn't bother to tell you about it. Listen to me. I know you don't want to believe it. This doesn't end the way you think. This isn't just a robbery anymore. It's murder. And now we've seen your faces. Do you really think she's just going to let us go? I told you that wasn't supposed to happen. And we certainly don't plan on adding to it. Like you said, how much of tonight's gone according to the plan? Yeah. Okay, we'll wait to hear from you. Like, do you confirm with okay. him? He wasn't the one who was shot. Give him some time. Okay, he'll figure something out. Friend of yours? Would you shut up? You know what? I have to go to the bathroom. It's okay. I'll be fine. Let's go. Go! Leave it open. Do you think I'm gonna run and abandon my daughter? What mother would do that? Okay. See what we can find out. It's not too late. Right now, you still have options. Why don't you stop talking and focus on what you're doing? 
There are better choices you can make. Before things get any worse. Better choices for you. And your baby. How far along are you? Three months. A woman knows, especially a mom. It wasn't exactly part of our plan. That seems to be the theme of the night. Being pregnant is hard enough. The fear we carry for our kids, wanting to keep them safe. And on top of this, I can't even imagine what you're going through. The streets of affluent Everton Canyon remain under lockdown tonight as a dedicated police manhunt continues. Local law enforcement have cordoned off neighboring streets and are going door to door in search of two criminals wanted for the home invasion before and the first to end in tragedy with the murder of the homeowner, John Randall. Looks like you like ran out. I know what that's like. Dad, we went into remission and we thought we beat it, but then the cancer came back, hard. I'm sorry, kid, but I don't believe in luck. Those are the only things you can count. So. Which one of those went wrong? Sorry, my nerves aren't cooperating. I know you're scared. You're just reacting trying to do what's best for you and the baby. Not to mention the crazy swirl of hormones you're dealing with. I would hate to see where the baby grows up without its mother. There's still a chance to avoid that. Okay, enough talking. Let's go. Sure. Did something happen? I'm fine. Sit down. Be a little pushy. aren't going anywhere for a while. Get Dean back on the phone and find out. We've got company. It's my boss. How did he get past the gates? He has the code. I told you you should have let me call him back. We are way past that now. Let's get everyone in the back room. Keep quiet. If he thinks no one's home, he'll leave. He has the key. Okay, then. Looks like the value of this property is about to take a substantial hit. No, we're not doing that. Okay, well then what's your bright idea? Give me your phone. Susan, I'm at the house. Apparently, so are you. I... Finally. Oh. 
Susan? Susan, I don't know what kind of game you're playing, but I expected you to be more professional. What the hell? Hi there. Susan? Sorry, I haven't called you back. You okay? No. <laughs> Good, you're awake. You know, for the record, if someone doesn't answer, wait for them to call you back. Otherwise, it's annoying. Yeah, so that's smart. <laughs> okay. Let's talk. How much do you want? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Blunt. Is that your winning negotiating style, Paul? I like to think it's direct. And so far, it's served me well. So what's it going to cost? What are you doing? Negotiating. Watch and learn. Typical. Thinking you can just deal your way out of any problem. Almost everything in life is a negotiation. Certainly this is. You're thieves. So deep down, you want money. You're only here because... You need somewhere to hide, right? What can we do to satisfy both parties? Make an offer. Unbelievable. There's always a deal to be made, a number. What is it? Or maybe there's not. <laughs> Play this smart. I'm offering you real money here. Cash in your pocket. Please stop. There's a price for everything. Name it. Is that so? Tell me, Paul. What's the price for your life? 50,000. Get us 50,000 and we'll go. Done! What the? They killed someone! We have seen their faces. You really think they're gonna let us go? For money? Yeah, I do. Even thieves have a code of honor. Is that what you tell yourself? Let me give you a little trade secret, Susan. There's always a deal to be made. Maybe if you realize that, you'd be better at your job. Maybe you wouldn't be losing your house. Yeah. He's exactly how you described him. Here's a problem, Paul. We've got more than that in the trunk of our car downstairs. It's all I can transfer without a delay of funds. And besides, are you saying you couldn't use an extra $50,000? And what? You think you're just going to drive us out of here that easy? That's exactly what I'll do. That won't be suspicious. It happens all the time. People want to see the lights, the view, especially a house like this. Once we're clear, I'll transfer the money. You can even take my car, and we never have to see each other again. I'd, I'd appreciate if you leave it intact. It's a lease. Take the offer. It gives you what you want, a safe way out, and money for the baby. I need to make a call. Watch. You didn't know. You have a deal. Let's move. You might want to lose that shirt. There's a box of clothes in my car. My husband's, I was donating them. You might be able to find something that fits. Yeah, get the rest of our stuff while you're at it. Getting rid of dead stuff. Cleaning things up. Sounds more like you're clearing it out. He's not gonna need them anymore, honey. That was one of his favorite shirts. Thank you. Okay. Say goodbye. I'll be back as soon as they set me free. I'll be okay.
This is how I like to do business with people who have clear goals and don't play games. And you swivel your chair around. Back to back, just do it. When are you going to tell me? About what? About the house and selling it? Oh, I didn't want you to find out this way. I saw the flyer on your laptop. Were you even going to tell me? Of course. Now is not the time. We have bigger things to worry about right now. Might be our only time. Don't talk like that. We're going to be okay. You don't know that. We will if I have anything to say about it. Get closer. He wants to talk to you. Paul McGlynn speaking. Transfer the money now. That wasn't our agreement. Consider this a renegotiation. Transfer the money. I'm sorry, but those terms are unacceptable. Once I get us past the checkpoint, I'll make the transfer as we agreed. I'm good for it. Transfer the money now. I'm not going to do that if you'll just abide by our original agreement. Do it. Ah! Wait. Again. Even though I'm not there, I'm still in control. Not you. After I make the transfer. You have my word. Okay. Okay, I... I, I need my phone. End of the property, there's a side gate. It empties out into a drainage. And for the police, I'll be right behind you. They're jogging this morning. You have to keep moving. I'm at that point. Just go. Drive! Right now! What's 
to the car and I won't hurt her I'm not asking again uh -uh. up front with me mom slide over please put your hand through the headrest put those on your mother nice and tight Yeah, I just ran in. Just a pretty face. You're, you're how they knew who to rob. Who was home. Who was on vacation. Who owned things worth stealing. Everybody's gotta have a sidekick these days. I was on duty tonight. I'm sure they're not home when we break into the place. Until today, you mean. Hmm. That was unfortunate. Take this. There's stuff. You know, I've worked here for five years. Five. How many of these residents do you think know my name? I'll tell you. Three. Hmm. The rest of them barely make eye contact. You know why? Because on the rare occasion, they do bother to look at me. They see me as beneath them. Some blue-collar schlub they don't even deem worthy to acknowledge. Do you know how I side for these people? Hanging new holiday lights or fixing gutters? Every time, every time, they complain. They try to pay less than we agreed upon. Renegotiating the price after the job is done. Trying to skimp out on the bill and screw the little guy. So that makes it all right? To take what's not yours? I'm taking what they owe me. Besides, this is all insured. Replaceable. <laughs> These people could stand to learn a lesson or two. So what lesson do you think you're teaching them? that they have way more than they'll ever need. That physical mouth of a suburban princess. Tell me, what Ivy League university will you be attending this year? You don't know anything about me. I know your type. I get ignored by them every day. They turn away without even bothering to wave. Maybe that's because they think you're a creep. Can be really sweet. Get your hands off of her. <laughs> you don't know us. You're just lumping us into your story to make things easier for you. Unit seven, you copy? Yep. Hold that thought. Dispatch, Help! we scream about. Unit seven, everything okay? Dispatch, this is unit seven. Sorry, sorry about that. Got a little bit of a squelch there. 
Uh, all clear on my side. I am still out on patrol, though I don't exactly know why with all these cop cars around. Don't get too comfy. We just got word the police are expanding their search area. Barricades are coming down within the hour. Yeah, I guess we're going back to work then. Let me know when they're all clear. Over. Looks like we're out of here sooner than we thought. Let's get this mess cleaned up. You're not sporting a bullet hole. There were always risks. We knew that. Not like this. Not before today. You said no one would be home. He wasn't supposed to be. And him owning a gun? You didn't know about that either. Must have been new. It's not like they tell me everything. I know how that feels. Something on your mind? Natalie? The guns? It was a precaution. I'd say you're pretty lucky she had it. No weapons. That was our agreement. That was my rule. Yeah, well, your rule had to go out the window in order to score something this big. If you want to raise a difference, what would it have made? I'd have quit. This wasn't part of the plan. Once we get out of this, I take my cut. I'm out. You two can go form your happy family. Oh, yeah. There's something else you forgot to tell me about. should have told me about the house. I wanted to. I just didn't know how. I was going to tell you. With a new life, that might hurt less. After everything we've been through, I just wanted you to hold on to being a teenager for a little longer. This house has some nice stuff. <laughs> Story. You sure about that? We should take one of them with us, in case we run into any trouble. No. That was never in the plan. Plans change. Besides, we need one of them for insurance. I said. So far, we have one for and one against. Baby, you're up. It's just a precaution. Like I said, it's gonna be fine. They're for insurance. Okay. Yeah, now let's take one. Good. It's all settled then. Take me. See, I'm gonna go with her. Because that way I know you're not gonna do anything to jeopardize us. We don't need her. You were outvoted. Baby, help me wipe down the car. You have to let us go before they come back. We'll speak on your behalf, say you helped us. I can't. What do you think's about to happen? This is about to get very bad. Trust me, I know where the deal's gone south. I have had my share. I'll protect her. I'll keep her safe, I promise. You're not even safe. It's two against one. Think about it. Think about everything that's gone wrong tonight. Do you really think he didn't know the owner would come home? I... Why would he lie? You tell me. Their baby. Where does that leave you? Why didn't you finish him at the house? Huh? Let the cops find him. That was the plan, remember? Close the loop. Yeah, I know. It's bad enough that the cops already suspect neighborhood security. What did you want me to do? Okay, the plans changed. The owner came home, like you said, but... He had a gun. I, I, I panicked. Okay, I... You were terrified. Keith saved me, okay? Saved us. I'm sorry. It's okay, all right? It's fine. It's fine. You always fix it. Look, we're running out of time. You don't believe me? Find out for yourself.
out there, are they? Casualties. Two innocents. They saw his face. It's a senseless tragedy. Look, I I'm not crazy about it either. But that's the only way out of this for us. You know that. There can't be any witnesses, nobody to, to contradict our story. This is the only way. This gives us a chance. Gives our family a chance. Know where to run down here.
Let's move. Where's Heather? We got separated. Let's find her. Come on. And we'll go. You're not taking her. Like I said, insurance. Baby, baby, come on, we gotta go. Not without the money. Bring it. Now. It's okay. Toss it over. Open it. Is this a joke? It's insurance. Let her go. It's all yours. You first. No! Baby! Baby, come on! They are almost here! I told you not without the money! We'll get more! No! Think about the baby. Oh, screw the baby! I'm getting what's mine! Your turn! It's all yours! No! No! Shouldn't be too hard to find. It's only 70 acres. You son of a bitch! I'm sorry I didn't tell you about the house. I don't have to go. We can use my tuition to pay for the house. No, baby. Absolutely not. I won't allow it. Your dad wouldn't have either. Besides, it's just too much for me now. Without you, too many memories. But it's your home. It's just a house, baby. You're my home. Absolutely. You don't need to drive me, you know. Of course I do. We can spend some time together. Besides, I want to see your new world. But you have so much to do. Oh, I can wait. It's a 60 day escrow. There's plenty of time. townhouse. I want pictures. Lots of them. Especially in my room. You'll get them. No! No! No, get off! No! Uh, 
No, 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 no,